Hey everyone, it's Exo Man, and I have a quick little review for you of a work boot, actually a, a rain boot or a mud boot, if you will. Uh, this is not a paid review. I, I don't really as yet do paid reviews. I may one day if I choose to, and then people can gripe if they want. But I, I, I don't want to. I just don't do that right now. Um, <clears throat> we've had a few offers, and it just hasn't appealed to us. But so let me uh, let me show you this boot that I want to talk about. Let me turn this around here. You see, this is my uh, extra tough boot. Okay. Now, if you can, if you look right here, let me see if I can show you. Look at that. Can you see bubbles coming out? Okay, that's because <clears throat> this boot has failed over time. Uh, this is not a negative review. It's actually a pretty positive review. I, I, I love these boots, by the way. They, like I said, they're called Extra Tough. E X or X T R A T U F, and they cost me, I think, sixty or seventy dollars. They're not cheap, but they're basically a sneaker style boot. And out here on the farm, it gets. Pardon me. We're throwing out some some uh, <coughs> recycled stuff. It gets pretty muddy sometimes. I have to pave this eventually. So these kind of these kind of boots are very necessary, so that I can go and feed the animals and and walk through mud and such. But so this this I will I will probably patch and I'll show you how I do it. But as you can see, right there, kind of on that seam where that hardened edge is on that toe, right there, it has failed. And so I'm ending up with, of course, wet socks, which is no fun. But if you're looking for a good boot that will last you a season or two, yeah, that's it. And I do a lot of walking, as you all can see from my videos. And I've probably put quite a few miles on these boots and nothing lasts forever. But they're good, really good quality. I like the nice big open mouth. You can slide your foot right down in there. Uh, I have the other higher boots that I don't care for too much because I'm not going anything really deep. And this is not as much of a commitment in footwear. I can slip them on really quick and get all the protection I need. Except for that. <clears throat> this side has not failed yet, but it's, it's close. So you see, it's just on the stress area. <clears throat> and like I say, I'll probably patch that and use it for another two seasons. So there you go. There's there's my review review of this of this tennis shoe styled boot. All right. Thanks for watching, everyone.